Casey, South Carolina. Chase Stevens come to your town. May 17th. Russell Force, you have your group. And I understand. You picked a really, really good group of professional wrestlers to stand for you. And for that, I'm backing you. I can't wait to show up May 17th and watch Russell Force take over. That's what the sport's about. Real professionals that travel down the road pay hard-earned dues to get in the ring with real professional wrestlers. Championship material. Each and every person at Russell Force deserves a shot at this title. And May 17th, each and every person in that ring should be a champion. Yeah, we got the victory. We got a win, and we got five points in the tag team series. This isn't the way the Fortunate Sons like to gain our victories. By two guys who have nothing left to prove and just want to show how tough they are. Want to try and gouge my eye out? You want to try and take me out of professional wrestling? It's not going to happen. See, the Fortunate Sons like to have a good time. But on May 17th, it's no longer about having fun, is it, Jesse? May 17th, we take on the House of Style. BJ Hancock, Michael Freely. This is the end. We will beat you. We will have a shot at the WrestleForce Tag Team Championship. May 17th have one hell of an opportunity. It's gonna be myself going one-on-one -on -one with Chase Stevens, the Wrestle Force Champion, the World Travel Veteran, the former TNA Superstar. This is a big match for me. And, you know, I know I'm the underdog here. I know, Chase, that you are probably already counting me out. You're already underestimating me, and I get it. It's fine, I understand. Because you're looking at a guy who just won his first Wrestle Force match. That's right, and I can't argue with that. That's right, I am one in three in Wrestle Force competition. The thing about it is, Chase, is that I took each and every one of those athletes to the very limit. It is no easy task defeating Anthony Henry, despite what you might think. So go ahead. Underestimate me. I hope you do, because I thrive in those situations. I thrive on being the underdog. I thrive on rising above and proving everybody wrong. See, because I work my ass off every single day to get better. Every single day, I eat, I sleep, I breathe this business. So, May 17th, Chase, please come prepared. Please don't count me out because I'm coming to win. All right, guys. We all know what's at stake. We all know what's coming. These guys have come in here time after time. They've jumped us while our backs are turned. And quite frankly, I've had enough of it. I'm tired of it. This is WrestleForce. This is our house. This is where we live. And we're not letting anybody come in here and do this to us. It's happened too many times. And they have to jump us when our backs are turned. And this time, it's not going to happen. Our backs are not turned. We're expecting them. We're welcoming them in. We want them here. And we're going to be waiting inside the cage. It's time to get revenge. It's time to handle our business. It's the reason I've chosen you guys to represent WrestleForce, to take back WrestleForce against Impact Wrestling. May 17th, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen inside the cage, War Games. 
you all know what's at stake. Because if it doesn't happen, if you guys can't pull it out and take back WrestleForce from Impact Wrestling, there may not be a WrestleForce. So the question is, are you guys ready to go to war with me? Yeah, yeah. It's time for war. It's time for war.